Hello and welcome back to Satisfactory. This is Cat from Sky and I uh, and mine, I guess, mine. <laughs> A new series, Train Lab. <laughs> We're going to go directly for trains and we have had a very efficient start. So oh, hopefully yes. we'll get to trains before, I don't know, the next major batch content update. <laughs> yes, indeed. I think we'll easily make it. I think within a couple of episodes, the way we've been going. Oh my gosh, it's been fast. So yeah, I think yeah. we decided to do a revamp of the factory and actually start automating things. Oh, there's the pod back. Yay. I'll pick some research. Um, but I think you were going to deconstruct the stuff and we we're going to set up some mining up here and then the smelting as well, right? Yeah. So what I'm going to do now is... Uh... I emptied the miners, or I picked up the miners, so I'm mm -hmm. going to get rid of the ore into the smelters and let them stay up for a bit while I build. Okay. Let's see, I took all the iron now. I hope that's okay. Yeah, 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 of course. I'm just going to build some extra stuff for the pod. Um, I'll go and choose a research real quick. Mm -hmm. All right, what do we want? Um... I don't think we need chainsaws, do we? Do we need walkways? Is that important? I don't think we care. I don't think so. I don't Until think we... those connect to like rail stations or anything. No, I think we might need that. They're really good for like exploring if we need to get up really high. Uh, so we might take them for that. But uh, sure. I'm guessing there's actually not much left. How do we select a the next? here oh we need to build a space elevator right Ooh, right okay. oh yes uh so. that reminds me what i'm going to set as the very first is the concrete maker oh that's good yeah all right so i've chosen personal storage that seems to be the thing that we would need most uh there's not actually much that we need so we can probably go for the space elevator uh contents next i think that would make some sense to do yeah, I agree. Yeah. This. Uh, makes sense to me as well. Uh, concrete. This is so cool. I'm cat crafting and I can see you building behind. <laughs> this is so nice. <laughs> we have actual things that we can watch while we're cat crafting. <laughs> oh, and I'm just case... quickly setting up. <laughs> nice. Uh, in case you're not familiar with the term cat crafting, we have uh, sort of coined that last <laughs> time we played because it's like, oh yeah, you just have to have your cat sit on your space bar and you're fine. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. It's funny because I actually made an uh, emoticon in um, on Twitch for that. So I have a cat crafting emoticon. <laughs> Legit. <laughs> ah, that's brilliant. <laughs> All right, this is great. So, are we going to down clock this thing? Have you done that already? The, uh, oh, uh, this is new. No, I just ah. played it. Okay, let's see. It's uh, 60 per minute. This eats 45 per minute. So, it has to be at a naughty ratio of check, <laughs> change, and check. 75 <laughs> percent. <laughs> is it? You're better uh, with the numbers than I. Am. 45, uh, 75. Yeah. It is 60 to 45 is. There it is. Ah, I see. Yes. 45 per minute. Good. So, and um, when you down clock things, they use lots of elect lots less electricity in this game. It's not a linear uh, ratio, is it? Or is it? Is it? I don't know if it is. No, it's not. So they, uh, when you down clock, they use less electricity, but so much less that they actually use less per product made. Oh, well, that's nice. So, so down clocking saves you uh, loads of power. And that's great usually. because we're still working with biomass, which is a pain in the socks to keep running. So I'm going to check yes. on the, the burners <laughs> right now and make sure that we have enough in each of our power plants. I don't think we... I'm not lacking too badly here. I don't know how many we're using. These guys. Uh, I filled uh, two of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll. We're, fill we're not using much. We a have third one, but no, we don't. We don't even need the power. 
I think do they no. do they only produce as much as we need? The yes. um Okay, okay, they so we're not losing only produce No no no, not losing anything. It's not like the nuclear in Factorio. Okay, but it's... it is like the steam engines in Factorio. They only produce what we need, essentially. Yes. Yes, yeah. Okay. Okay, so these seem to be done. I'm going to take out the end products here of the smelters so that you can remove them if you want to. And um, we decided to have one person removing all of the machines so they get the materials back. Um, and I will just cat craft for the next milestone then. Sure, yeah. Well, I don't think that... I keep thinking about cats melting. <laughs> but it could be cats melting, as in, you know, if you put them in the sun too long, they might melt. <laughs> Mine love to sit in the sun. <laughs> I think I'm going to try to do that. I promised people on stream to have a cat cam for my window. And so maybe before the stream, what I'll do is I'll put the cat in the window and see if she'll stay there. And uh, maybe she will, maybe she won't, but it'll be an interesting experiment and it might be fun to watch. I don't know. We shall see. Yeah, I think it's definitely going to be entertaining. <laughs> the, uh, yeah, those cats are so beautiful. Oh, thank you. I love them so, so much. They, they love each other, too. And that's that's a nice thing that they just they care about each other they explore things together they play together they wrestle they i don't know they're just they, they're best of friends those two girlies they're so special love them oh that's great it's just weird it's so um i don't know serendipitous maybe the right word that they both ended up being gray cats because when we we went to the shelter to get them we were just wanting to get um just cats that had a personality that kind of matched what what we wanted or what we get along with or whatever and um they just both happen to be gray so people tease us like we have a matching set <laughs> <laughs> yeah they're so cute okay so we have milestone completed uh, there we go this and click the button. Yay. Boom. Okay. Very nice. So. Do you need help tearing down the smelters, by the way? <laughs> I don't know where you are. Oh my god, you're building. Oh. Oh yeah, I'm building. Nice. Uh, I just uh, okay. didn't want to tear them down yeah. while they were smelting, so I ended up with yeah. all the. So I just okay. uh, started oh, that building. Makes sense. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm arranging these for iron ingots, and I'm going to put in all the extra ore that I have here. Mm, nice. Oh, yeah. I'm going to do the same for iron. There we go. Okay, nice. That's great. And then I can always cat smelt the rest. Okay, so I'm going to look at your, your yeah, setup Yeah, you can destroy here. it as well by now. Uh, the okay. setup is a bit... Uh, let's see. So you've got it going to three different machines. That's nice. Yeah, but I'm going to split it so uh, so it goes into... I was thinking uh, either making four or making eight. Mm -hmm. Because if it's four, then we... Um, let's see. Uh, clocking down the miner now to 50% because we only have the slowest belt. Mm -hmm. But... Um, yeah, if it's four, it fits the MK1 miner. If it's eight, it fits the MK2. So it depends on how how far ahead we think. Well, we're, we're going to the future, so go as far as you want. That's what I would say. But I think it also depends okay. on the belt technology. Let me see if we... I think we need to build the space elevator to get the better Mark II belts uh, to transport yeah. more resources. Um, so. MK2 miners are a bit ahead. But the smelters aren't okay. very expensive, so might as well just place them. Yeah, and, sounds good. Uh, yeah, that reserves the space as well, so we don't... Uh... Mm -hmm. Okay, let's choose a new tech. Wow, oh, we have, have run out of useful tech. Um, uh oh. You know. So how are we doing on uh, concrete? Not 
very well. We might actually want to use the uh, slug for... For the concrete? Yeah. Okay. Or we can uh, place uh, a temporary assembly with... Uh, with uh, one of the like portable miners, a couple of thousand, and then just mm -hmm. move it in. Or we can find there's uh, a couple of other spots for it as well. Around. There, there is another. Um, I believe it's just past this area. There's a tree, yeah, and there's. I think there is concrete or rock down here, stone somewhere. Do I remember correctly? Yeah, there it is. There it is. Okay, so there is stone over here which we could bring by conveyor belt that way and have it all in the same spot if we wanted to. Should I work on that? Do you see where I am? Sure. Sort of jumping. Uh, I'm, yeah, I know where you are. But, but okay. Yeah, I don't go into the YouTubes. Yes, I see you jump. You have the <laughs> headlight on. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm going to uh, prepare this patch. And um, I think we can run a belt that way. This is kind of what I did in my other game as well. I ran the belt on the side, you know, around the copper way and then kind of put it around and uh, took it that way. But we could take it a different way too. I'm going to take all of this lovely biomass and uh, yeah, we no longer call these bushes or shrubs. No, no. This is biomass. <laughs> Pre-biomass <laughs> stuff. Yeah. A pre-biofuel yeah. state of existence. It's fine. We're robot people. We're great. Wait, have we decided nice. are we actually people in this or are we like robots like in factorio I, think... hmm? I don't know yeah, i don't know either I don't know. uh but we do Bear i guess we do get a copy if we die yeah that's true because i think we do actually die don't we like when we fall off a uh, thing or do we just need to be repaired <laughs> The existential questions of Satisfactory. Now on your latest YouTube. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this was a very complicated question. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. I'm using way too many splitters here. I don't like to to make these like splitter lines, but I'm going to. You do. No, don't don't say you don't. I've seen you use splitters. Splitters like a madman. It's great. They're fantastic. <laughs> they look cool. <laughs> Yeah, they do. They do, but I like to always split into three and three, mm -hmm. so it looks more. Uh, so I use all of the exits, but now I I'm splitting into two and two. So I use like one splitter for each smelter. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. Does that does that work with the ratios though? Like with the. Do we need? Yeah, to as long as the belts are. Fine. And they will be. Yeah. Okay. Work. Nice. But it, but it might cut two extra speedy belts instead of them. Okay. I'm going to check my internet because you are roboting just a teeny bit. Um, oh. Well, I guess we solved the existential crisis there. <laughs> yes, we did. Okay, so. <laughs> okay. Satisfactory robots confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right, I'm going to make some more biofuel with all the leaves that I just got, uh, gathered. And uh, I got some more berries in case you want to entice the doggo if we see him or her again. Mm. Yeah, that would be nice. Oh, this is good. We have all the stuff and all the things. Yeah, it's, yeah, the smelters are running now as well. And let's see. First of all, I'm going to connect. No. I'm going to let you do the constructors if you want to. Um, okay. Uh, only if you want to. Do we know what we're? Uh, I mean, if you if you have a vision in mind, go ahead. I, I'm more. I'm kind of focused on doing the milestones with just the random stuff that I'm picking up. Okay. Yeah, I'll I'll see if I get a. Uh, I don't know. A idea. Mm -hmm. Uh, because these, uh, a smelter uh, connects directly to an assembler for plates. If, because uh, yeah. that's like 30 to 30. Is it 30 to 30? Then, okay. 
Oh, am I remembering it? I, I don't remember it at all. I, we, were, we were just talking about that the assembler was slow when it was making those plates just now. If that makes sense. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, but that was because it eats two per plate. So so it can basically oh. fill uh, two. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Yep, that makes yeah. sense. Um, uh, but I think they... I'm going to make one empty just in sort. Put the excess stuff and in here. Nice. Then I need to make stuff. All right, let's go to the new smelting columns. Yay. But I'm not sure how close they should be, but it doesn't matter if they are close, really. So I'm going to build it somewhat close. Yeah, as long as we can get through, like jump through, literally. It should be fine. 30 no power. to 30. Yeah, that's fine. Ah, we need to connect some of these thingy majingies. I don't think I have power. Yeah, I placed the power poles, but not the lines yet. Okay, I will go and get some power going on. I need to get more cable, mm -hmm. which means I need to get more copper ore, which means I need to make it into cat smelted ingots. <laughs> Oh, I, have I have a bunch, four. if you want. No, no, that's okay. Uh, I'll get some. Wire. I just okay. need to make some of that cable. Okay. Let's see. Cat's melting for the win. Two. Two. Oh. Yeah, I made a couple of more poles than needed. I don't think that there, there there is such a thing. <laughs> I don't think there is such a thing. No. no. Okay, I'm, I can place power poles now. Let's just do that and... Oh, you've already done it. Nice. Yeah, I, I placed the things. Yeah. And, uh, let's see. Okay, I'll use the wire for the uh, milestone then. Until we sort this properly, um, yeah, the ratios are going to be messed up for these. So I'm just going to let's see. We produce sixty a minute, and they eat thirty, and we have eight of them. So we have. Uh, we have a slight deficiency there, I, but there are more iron patches up there, so we can just add more miners, right? For that. Yeah, and um, but but we need faster belts anyway because the belt only. Mm -hmm. Ah yes. Ah yes. Oh, yes, we. Uh, but I see what you mean. We can do a uh, separate as well. Um. But how? There's no room for that now. I built it for late, <laughs> but but I should have. Uh, it's okay. It you know what somebody told me earlier. It's so easy to tear things down in this game. It's really easy to move stuff. This person said to me. I can't yes. remember who it could have been. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I just need to find the correct place to tear it down. I can't merge it here. I need to merge it later, and that means, oh, silly me. Let's see. If I remove this, uh, might be good to put the space elevator down temporarily. I'm thinking. So I'm gonna. I think after I finish this current milestone, I'm going to work on the space elevator and see what we need for that. Yeah. Sure. Oh, this might be nice. This might be spaghetti. <laughs> Ooh, nice uh, but, spaghetti. But might that be. sounds very tasty. Yeah, it might be beautiful spaghetti. I'll see when it's done. Ooh. Because I have to, may have to, sh like, shift the belts a bit. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this. So, so everything's this. going to be a bit skewed. It's okay. It sounds, it sounds intriguing. I want to see this beautiful spaghetti because in your last series oh my goodness 
the spaghetti was exquisite. It was so fun. Uh, I really enjoyed seeing that. It was just great. Okay, so we need 10 reinforced iron plates. And we can make two. Okay. Good start. Good start. Fine. So screws are I like from... one. Uh, oh, it's... Hmm? I like when spaghetti in this game is... Uh... Is um, messy mm -hmm. because uh, we can build in, you know, up. So, oh no, uh, this doesn't work because of the power poles. Guess we have to remove power poles. <laughs> okay, I can do the next move. Milestone. Oops, I almost fell down. <laughs> Careful. Boom. There we go. All right, next thing is the elevator to space. Player upgraded. Nice. Now then, this is the wrong menu. Right menu, where are you? There you go. Special space elevator. All right, we need a billion pieces of concrete. 500, you know what? I'm gonna add this to my little list here, to-do list. It makes it easier to keep mm. track of stuff. Wow, we need stuff. Yeah, Holy fuzzy Oh, look cats. at this, it worked. <laughs> where, where, I had where? to shift them, uh, shift the splitters one, so I could. Uh, but, but the end result was, uh, I like the end result. Oh wow, this looks very uh, the, nice. Oh well then. Be... <laughs> <laughs> yes. I was I like, like it. where's the spaghetti? I want to see this. And there are noodles down here. <laughs> <laughs> Bandy noodles. Is so yes. beautiful. Wow. <laughs> All right, so this but is this probably... is going to huh? be shifted back when we get miners too. <laughs> uh, so it's temporary, but long time temporary. Long time temporary. Oh. Okay, I I might have taken some photographs of this beautiful spaghettiness to put for like the thumbnail or something. Yeah, it is very <laughs> lovely. <laughs> so nice. Take these. So that means we have like. Uh, let's see, 68 and 60, we'll have 120 ores uh, a minute. And... This is good. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I love your spaghetti. You're probably the best spaghetti builder I have seen in Satisfactory. Yes. And and I don't, I hope that nobody links in the comments. There's, a, there's one person who does weird things like a tornado looking thing or braided belts. That's not the same kind. This is purely spontaneous mm. random spaghetti and that's the best kind i think so, i i like so this nice. kind as well because the whole point is to make uh completely functional yeah uh, to make it functional when you start off with wrong mm -hmm. <laughs> it, it happens to make it great. yeah and it's so fun with the squiggly belts because they they're great. Yes. See, so, uh, production and constructor. Okay, I'm going to work on space elevator. So if you decide to work on that, let me know, because there's a lot of materials and I don't want to duplicate too much. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, I'm just going to set up some, um, uh, some uh, automation. Mm-hmm. Nice. So, so we get uh, uh, the base materials automated, at least. Okay. I wonder if I should set up just a temporary copper smelter, because at the moment we don't have any copper smelting happening, and we're going to need... We're going to need quite sure. a lot of it, actually. So I think I'm going to set up a smelter just right here, or maybe two. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Seven. Oh, unless you're going to work on this. I see you you're walking this way. No, no, feel free. I'm just... I'm just uh, while you are talking uh, i'm just looking at it so i can respond okay uh, and, uh, there we go that's to just... you at the same time <laughs> there we go and i'm just gonna grab the ore and just fill them from here i think that's fine yeah oh, how very how hmm. very i don't know temporary uh, unlike kos yes hey. oh, how, how very temporary <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. Oh yeah, we learn. We learn from from good practices with people we know. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! 
Here, we'll connect it there. It'll be fine. <laughs> Stupid power lines. I That is one thing I'm not a fan of in this game. The whole... Um, power lines can only be connected to four places and then you can upgrade that and it's just it just seems unnecessary for the game uh, but maybe I'm just meowing too much I don't know <laughs> what do you think about the power line limitations I don't know I think uh, I'm not sure if it's possible now but it would be nice to be able to quick replay uh, like you can ah, do with the belt so yeah. you could, could upgrade kind of mm -hmm. that would be great uh, other than that, I don't mind having many power poles. Uh, there are other upgrades in this game I mind more. I think mm -hmm. this game is in many more ways too convenient. I think the belts move too fast. Okay. Uh, I, I think uh, cars and trains should be... Uh, would be more, more necessary. Usable. Okay. Yeah. If, and maybe if like you they're, could they're just not... drag a belt. They're, maybe they're just too cheap, the belts. That That's kind of like maybe, the thing yeah. that that forces you to do trains in Factorio. Like, if you did belts all the way, uh, you know, in Factorio, it would be monstrously expensive. But in this game, yeah. I think it's actually probably cheaper to do belts than trains. So we might be setting ourselves up for a bit of a disaster, but it'll be <laughs> fine. I think it will be fine. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. The... And many things in this game is quite cheap. And uh, one of the reasons that I've thought about is the uh, mining spots are too good. I think there is yeah. too many pure spots. And it would be fun if the pure spots were in like dangerous late game areas. And mm -hmm. in the beginning, you had to make do with the uh, lesser spots. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. That, that's actually a really good reason to explore because right now there are lots of spots in very convenient places in the game so it doesn't actually push you to go forward at all so no and, uh, but I guess people want different things from the game and uh, mm -hmm. uh, I like the kind of game that kind of keeps uh, expanding uh, or keeps I don't know like escalating Escalating, yeah, that's a good yeah. word. Yeah. Or or keeps you maybe interested in exploring. You know. Yeah, that as well. Yes. And right now it's for for the hard drives, which is a very good incentive. Like. Yeah. I kind of um, wish that there were some things. I don't mind like the patches and stuff being known, but it would be nice if like the hard drive lo locations were randomized or something, to to make you actually have to explore. Yeah. Are you not yeah, because now you can go. Uh, oh, yes, I agree. Because now when you know the world, I don't know the world that well. So for me, I'm actually still exploring. Oh, yeah, me too. But, but I mean, there are maps out there that people use frequently that show all yes. the locations of all the things and all the stuff. You can even upload your save and it will tell you which ones you found and which ones not. <laughs> it's it's oh, interesting. Wow. Yeah, it, and you can actually track, oh yeah, I haven't gotten this, um, you know, this hard drive yet or whatever. It's too convenient, I think. Um, so. Yeah, um, I see. Okay, oh, I've speaking got... of that, I'm going to go pick up a hard drive, I think. Fantastic. Speaking of not knowing the world. <laughs> <laughs> The, uh -huh. This place has like a deserty valley quite close, so uh -huh. and, and there is that you can run, as in uh, you you get down into the valley on one side and then you run along it, pick up. Oh, I think it's at least a couple of hard drives on the way. Oh wow, that's nice. Um, okay, I maybe, think I kind of know what yeah. area you're talking about. Yeah, that's very interesting mm. place. Yeah, where the yeah deserty valley where the the, the ground is kind of uh, sandy, I think. If it's the same yeah. one I'm thinking of. Yes, it uh, probably is. And, uh, okay, let's put these in there. I'm going to need all my inventory space for building this thing. I'm almost ready to build the space elevator. Do you have an idea of where we might put it? I mean, don't come back. But um, if you have any thoughts. I do. Oh, uh, I'll wait till you get but... back. I still have lots of crafting left. so. Okay. Let's see. How much power does a biomass burner give? 
20. Let me look. The... Uh, 20, yeah. 20, yeah. 20. The cat crafting is real. Yeah, her as well. Making a craft bunch in the jungle to be able to get the resources <laughs> to build a second biomass burner. To wow. Oh, to open the hard drive thingy? Oh, yeah. wow. The fun is real. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I'm going to have to cat smelt because our, our smelting is not fast enough. No. Oh, wow. Which one? I'm just getting... I need 1,500 copper wire, so it's it's a struggle. But it'll be fine. Uh, copper, yeah. Yeah, it's just copper. No, we have more more iron uh, than we need at the moment, so I'm not worried about that. And I'm so glad we have a box. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What happened? Something shut down. It's not you. It's not you. Checking for... Oh, machine. Oh, uh, yeah. I heard something... I'm glad you didn't mean, like, the game. No, 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 not the game. <laughs> it's fine. I don't know what shut down because all of the burners have fuel. Huh. Don't know. I just heard a sound. You know, the, the, the shutting down sound? The one that you don't want to hear? <laughs> yeah. The scary sound? It might be connected to what? I don't know. I just ripped apart. Uh, oh! Um, did you disconnect a place? power plant? Yeah, but, but uh, a local power pole because I set up. Huh. Maybe that's there. what it is. Maybe it's just we hear the sounds from all over the base. I think we do actually. Maybe. Okay. Okay. As I got a hard drive this... and I got twenty-seven reinforced iron plates. Wow, oh, just... that is tasty. We're gonna need. I think that's one of the first uh, requirements for the space elevator: the reinforced iron plates. So that's gonna be yeah, very yeah. good. Nice. Very good. And I heard that they changed a lot of the uh, alternative recipes. Oh. So, like, the stitched plate isn't stitched anymore. I don't think it was the last time I played it, at least. It doesn't use copper anymore. Okay. It just makes it cheaper. Okay, so and they... Oh, that's interesting. Huh. I think... They changed, yeah, the alternative recipes do not necessarily need many alternative uh, resources. Ah, okay. I'm plugged in the hard drive now. We can look at it after. Okay. Oh, that's going to be exciting. Okay. Yeah, we're closing in on a space elevator, then we, then we uh, space elevate once, and <laughs> then we, I think. Space elevate. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I have almost enough. I'm, I'm just doing some cat crafting at the moment. Almost enough for the space elevator. And I assume oh, that the what concrete. Missing? I I'm just doing the final bits of copper, but I have enough. There we go. I'm just gonna uh, how much concrete more. do you need? Five hundred. Five hundred, and I have ninety-seven. So I think there's probably enough. Oh, in the box. it's just enough. Yeah. Oh, excellent. Okay, I'll grab that in a sec then. This is great. That's and that means we need modular frames and rotors. No, reinforced plates and something. Yeah, for the for the elevation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, why are almost stuff done? Space. Yes. Yeah, hopefully those space people catch it. <laughs> okay, <laughs> yeah. here we go. We have all the stuff. Boom. Okay, where do I put the thing? Uh, elevator. I don't know. I I moved. Uh, let's see. I can show you where I placed mine if you want. Sure. Yeah. First one I placed. You see the uh, arch up this way. Mhm. Mm I placed it like inside the arch, Ooh. but to make sure it hit it. Um, <laughs> but that was temporary. So, like. Yeah. Um, well, it's going to be temporary, uh, I think, because, like, late game... Yeah, I placed the... Yes, yes. But it's nice to have it as as a spot to look for. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, yes, yes. Up this hill. So a bit far wow. away, but very visible. Yeah. 
okay. And I placed inside this stone arch because that looked nice. Okay. Um, Wait, where did you go? go? And Ooh, it also gave me a reason way. to find a snail over Ah, that's quite nice. Yeah, this is quite far away for our first launch. I think we should put it a little bit closer, but then we can kind of... Ooh, hello. Sure. Oh, these are mushrooms. Okay, flower petal mushrooms. Bring the things. Uh, careful here, by the way. Yeah, I see them. I see them. <gasps> but yeah, so this is the place I had mine. But You had it above, you on know. top of the arch? No. Uh, whoop. Uh, okay, I, this is a little bit more dangerous than I thought. Damage to fix the property detected. Uh, <clears throat> yep. I placed it uh, inside the arch, so it okay. kind of circled it almost. Um, right oh boy, I'm gonna, I have issues. I have slight issues. Like, I'm gonna die. There we go. I'm dead. <laughs> I forgot my berries. Oh, the Catherine is dead. Uh oh. Yeah. Yeah. Reviving. Oh, you're revi- oh, crap! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! No! Okay, I'm gonna go back. Stay stay over there, and I will sure. come and get my body, so I know where you are. Sure. This way. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I, that's a shame, because I had all kinds of crap on me. <laughs> all the stuff. Uh, oh. The box is still here. Okay, good. Let's see. Yeah, inside the box, full inventory of stuff. Wow, oh, you yes. have many resources. Yeah, it's enough to build the space elevator. <laughs> ah, yes, of course. The elevator. Oh, yeah. there's a uh, something over there. That looks nice. Copper, maybe, or iron. Okay, coming. Yeah, it's uh, if you're down in the kind of valley we started in. There is yeah. like three different places. It's. Uh, one of the, I believe, one of the really good start. But it's it's a bit hard to build because it's not that open. But up here it is. So if we if we want to build up. Okay, I got the stuffs. Make sure I can equip my weapon. There we go. Boom. Mm -hmm. Now this is going to be a nice ending to the uh, episode as well. Getting the elevator down. Oh yes. But if okay. you feel it's too far away, uh, feel free to. Do you, do you want? Move do you closer. want to put it down here, like this far away, initially? I, I don't mind because we go to it one. And no, we, we go to it many times because we we forget what we need in it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good point. Don't, don't we? I mean. Uh, I think it's seventy-five reinforced iron and fifty modular frames. Okay, well, if you remember, and you're going to remember how much we need. Oh, there's a bird down there. How nice. I, yeah, I can pretend to remember at least. And then <laughs> if I forget, I can sneak up here and check. Okay, okay. Or I could sneak. It's it's fine. It's a nice it's a nice walk. So where does it go? Like... Oh. Uh, up to you. I placed it on the other side of the arch. Okay. Uh, like down there. I like that spot. But... Uh, here? Or... Yeah. If... Okay. But so, if uh, I, I'm sensing, I'm sensing. Uh, hmm? What are you sensing? Because I'm not I'm sensing, sensing anything. I want to place it somewhere else. <laughs> no, 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 not at all. I, I, no, I just want to make sure that it's not uh, yeah, hitting is... the like. It's not too far off the ground. Is that okay? Yeah, it's okay like this. It's beautiful. Oh, oh that's nice. Terrible. Line. Oh, that looks pretty good. Okay, so I'm quite happy with that. I didn't want it to be like, you know how sometimes it could be like really high off the ground, like it's rising. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, that's good. That's good. Like, you know how if you, if you have like a minor little cliff next to it or something? Oh, this is the best bit. Yeah. This is the best bit of the game. Oh, we watch <laughs> this. Watch it coming down to connect it. Oh yes. Oh. Yeah, that animation is good. This you can, is you can kind of feel the size of it. Yes. It's, it's animated. It's massive. Oh, that was good. Very satisfying. Oh, and the space elevatory thingy. There it comes. Sweet. Nice. 
Okay, I'm taking lots of pictures so that we can have a good thumbnail. Excellent. Oh, where did mm, you go? Good. I jumped down because ah. I'm going to check. Yep. Uh, yeah, I was wrong. It's 50 rotors and 75 reinforced. Okay, 50 rotors, 75 reinforced. Do we have rotors? I don't remember. We have the recipe, but we haven't okay. set up any of the using two items assembly bits. Yeah, I, I just didn't know if we had the recipe yet because I don't remember unlocking it, but it must have been with the modular frames, maybe? Oh, doggo berries? Yeah. Okay. Doggo berries. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I need to find some kind of berries myself because I am at three bars of health. Oh, yes. So that's not. Uh, you can have some mine. No, no. I, well, I mean, I'm just thinking of like, oh, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Yep. Hello. Oh. It's fine. We're fine. <laughs> okay, let's find our uh, our abode. There we go. Home is where the hub is. Oh, that's... <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll... Oh, there's a berry, Duggo berry plant, but I, I think we might have pilfered that already. There is some in the chest, so I'm not like yeah. worried, but it's... There's no nuts around here. Are there nuts here? The, um, I almost called them Koopo nuts. No, we call them a snack tree. That's right. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah. I, I don't think see we any have snack to go trees. to the, the desert. desert. But we, we will find some on the, um, coal. Okay. okay that's yeah. right. Well, I'm just, I, I just thought of them as a cheaper snack than berries. But here, berries are plentiful. So it shouldn't be, I shouldn't worry too much about it. Just eat the berries and be happy and life is better. Ooh, yeah, we also have some sticks. bacon mushrooms. Oh, um, yes. Oh, I found some quartz. Let me take that real quick and we can research that. Oh, Oh, and if we find some catarium, that would be good too. Because quartz, we know, unlocks the map, which is great. Ooh, yeah. This is a big chunk of quartz. 65. I might. You might know Knowledge the of the catarium. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Sounds very um, tasty nice. So I can go get some... Uh, I, I'm... Can we research it before we do this base elevation thingy? I don't think so, but uh, I might be wrong. Oh. There's a... There's an elevated plant here. <laughs> oh my god, it's like literally in midair. <laughs> Sometimes this game is uh, entertaining in many ways. <laughs> oh jeez! Oh oh, run 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 run! Oh dear! Oh dear! We have we have uh, I have a ram thing. One of those very dangerous shooty uh, da uh, fireball owies. Okay, okay, we might die. Fireball, uh, but not yet, not yet, not today. No, no, I'm good, I'm good. I ran it, I think. I think it's fine. Okay. Yeah, I didn't. I don't know where hey. you are. Oh. I'm, I'm. Hello. Yeah, I'm here. Hi. How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I got the quartz. <clears throat> we'll focus on the positive. It's fine. <clears throat> yes. <laughs> of course. I, yeah. I, I haven't played much that patch, but I remember when Yeah, I remember unlocking that. the quartz, the map thing. That's with the quartz. So I think we, I don't know yeah. when you can actually build that, but let's find out. Let's get that going. I think that's like plastic tech, but it might be a bit sooner. Steel, maybe. Okay. Uh, oh. Oh no, I came upon the mem when we're finished with alternative recipes. So mm -hmm. we have analysis of hard drive is completed. So we have alternative reinforced iron plates, uh, iron ingots or stitched iron plates. So the stitched is using copper wire and iron plates to make three reinforced iron plates. Um, the alternative oh. for, there's another alternative, which is, um, 10 iron plates plus 24 screws is three, uh, reinforced iron plates. That one yeah. is very efficient and easy to make. Uh, but I, I thought they removed the stitched ones. So oh. I was wrong. Uh, it's there. six, so six iron plates and 30 wire to make three plates. So this one actually hmm. uses less iron, much less iron. And more copper. Yeah, we have, we have a lot more iron than we do copper, though. Okay, so let's well, we'll go with the screw the... one then. 
Sure. Okay. Yeah, that, well, that's no, nice. The, the third one is alternative iron ingots, which is one iron ore and one copper ore to three ingots. Three iron ingots. So I don't think that one is needed right now, no. but we'll find more later. Yeah. But this place is overflowing with iron and there's not that much copper. Okay, I'll choose the, the one with the screws then. We'll get that one. Yeah. Nice. Okay. And then um, hopefully we get the screw one so we can bypass making it into rods. Oh, yes. Okay, let's see. Select an... Uh, I think we have to reconfigure the mem. Let's in... No, I don't want to do... Oh, here we go. Rock quartz. There we go. We have enough. So I'm going to set that as our analysis thingy. Or not. Hello. There it goes. Okay, it's being a little bit buggy on the interface, but yay. Uh, okay, it's it, gonna go. Uh, multiplayer issues. Or? I think it might be multiplayer issues. It's like you can't select the thing until you restart the, or re bring up the window. And then you can put the item in, but you can't click go. So then you redo the window again, and then you can click go. It's, yeah. Oh, wow, okay. Not Sorry. ideal, <laughs> but it's okay. Uh, yeah. All right. I'm Hopefully, we notes. don't get into issues with the trains and desync. Yeah. Like oh God, yes, trains and desync would be awful. Um, yeah. Get berries. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nice. So now, I guess we're doing the rotors and the thingies, but maybe we should work on those in the next uh, emanation. Yeah, I think so. I think so. Um, it should be fast to catcraft and use the production we have to mm -hmm. to get the things. Okay. And uh, then we can, um, yeah, do, we can do that in the next. Episode. All right. Sounds great. <laughs> so, <laughs> are you are you at a good stopping point then? Yes, I'm just catcrafting anyway right now. Ah, so. right. Okay. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Good. Good. And okay. uh, thank you everyone for watching and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>